So things are getting wild here in Studio A, one of our favorite segments of our weekend mornings with Christy Markham from the Wildlife World Zoo. Oh, Good morning. Thanks for being here. Yes. Um, and you have the cutest little guy with us. I hear his name is Milo. Yes. Is that right? That's right. And what is he? Look at those ears. Right? Yeah. So this is a serval kitten. Okay. He's only about two months old. This species is found in the sub-Saharan Africa. Wow. And his ears are quite large because these cats have the largest ears and the longest legs relative to their body size of any of the cats. Wow, that is great. He's like the Will Smith of the cats. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. He says it. So oh, what would he be like what would he be the most like that a name that people would know of the big cat family? Yeah. Okay, so they, uh, they're they really fast like cheetahs. Okay. Uh, they have the spots and the stripes. Being yeah. found in the sub-Sahara, actually one of their biggest predators is the jag uh, the leopard, I'm sorry. And, really? Whoops, it's the leopard. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. And then of course, humans, unfortunately, because their coats are so beautiful, they are hunted for their fur, mm -hmm. and they're also mm -hmm. hunted by farmers because they're thought of as pests, and, wow. and they do that to protect their livestock. Well, that's crazy. So how many kittens will uh, one of them have at a time? Like what's in their litter? So typically one to three is about average. Okay. And they're pretty solitary cats. So these guys aren't going to be found in big prides like lions would be. Uh, they're usually going to be found on their own. And he is very <laughs> playful. So these guys, they're really agile. They can run at speeds of 40 miles per hour. Oh, they can cool. leap six feet in the air and then wow. they can leap in 13 foot strides so they can leap 13 feet out okay and that's typically how they will get their prey so instead of attacking the jugular like most cat species uh, yeah these guys will rely on pouncing and stunning cool. their prey ah the, the element of surprise <laughs> absolutely is what they go for and so what are they eating kind of like little desert mice kind of thing yeah they okay. eat little rodents little animals birds lizards snakes yeah and they have the highest success rate of any of the other cats well yeah I, you know just watching a lot of things about animals just getting interested by having you here it seems like a lot of them strike out yeah mm -hmm. oh my gosh totally <laughs> they like go for the meal lions and tigers they have about a 10% success rate, yeah, 7 to good. 10. Yeah, these guys have about a 50 percent success oh, wow. rate so they are just outstanding hunters out there and they just all look <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't even want to mess with the toys he's I like know. you i want you so do you guys handle him right now we do so lauren our education curator is actually his primary handler wow mm. okay so no wonder he's very comfortable with you guys <laughs> and very bonded there um you were mentioning that this is a really fun time for you guys right now because you have a lot of babies going on over there. <laughs> we have so many babies at Wildlife World right now. Now we have babies year round because we do have over 6,000 animals. Correct. But right now we have a baby giraffe and baby <gasps> mountain lion cubs and so many other really amazing babies on exhibit and in our nursery. So it's just prime time to come out because you can't beat the weather either. <laughs> He's like, I want more.